Earlier this week, I was privileged with a number of other people to stand with Israel. We went to a march in the center of town to declare our support for our state, for our homeland. Although we're very, very privileged to live in England, to be able to have a homeland for the Jewish people is something which we, our generations, are very, very privileged to have and it's something which we support wholeheartedly. But when we say we are with the state of Israel, or when we are with anyone or anything, I say, I'm with you, we are with you. What exactly does that mean? And in Parashat Baha'u'llah, we actually have the word with you repeated twice in subtly different ways. And we see perhaps the two different ways in which we can be with someone. And they're very, very different. Moshe's father-in-law, Yitro, is now currently with the Jewish people. But he's really come as an outsider. He came as somebody who was really part of a different religion, although his daughter obviously converted to marry Moshe, but he in a sense was still part of a different nation, and he just came along and he's been with the Jewish people since just after the Torah was given. And there comes this point in Parashat Baratcha where he's getting ready to leave. And Moshe says to him, stay with us, continue on our journey with us. And the first time he says it, he says, Lecha itanu vehitavnu lach. Lecha itanu. Itanu, come with us. This word, itanu. That is one way in which we say with us in Hebrew. And the response is, no, I'm not going to come with you. But then Moshe tries again. And he says, or he suggests, Vahaya ki imanu. Why don't you come with us? Imanu. The first time he says, itanu, with us. And the second time he says, imanu with us. What is the difference between the two? The Vilna Gaon suggests, this is based on our parasha and other places as well, that when we say itanu, there's with us in the sense of happening to be with us. We are with, you know, a number of people, we live with neighbors because we both happen, we all happen to choose to be in that same area. We perhaps are, uh, well, with a certain group in a certain place. We're with other people on the train because we all happen to get on the train at the same time. We're with them in that sense. But that's almost coincidental. There's no real, we're not with them in spirit, we're not with them in essence. We're in a sense just with them because we happen to be with them in that moment. That is itanu. But when Moshe comes back the second time and he says, Vahayaki teleich imanu, imanu is something much stronger. To be with someone in that sense it means to be with them in body, in heart, and in soul. To be together with them, to feel what they feel, to, to, for their joys to be your joys, for their pains, their difficulties, their challenges to be yours as well. To share that with somebody is a much, much deeper being with someone. And that is the with that we try to emulate as a community and as a nation. That when we stand with Israel and when we're there for each other, when we are with our people, when we are with our friends, when we are with our family, or are with them, Imanu, that is the one that we try to emulate. And what Yitro was saying to Moshe is, I don't want to just be with the Jewish people if I'm just going to be a tag along. I don't want to be there if I'm just Itanu, just happening to hang around because it suits me at the moment. That's not a real with. What I want if I'm going to be part of this nation is to be properly part of this nation, to really experience the highs and the lows together, to be a part of it, to be with you in the fullest sense. And that's obviously something that we try to do with all of our family, friends, and our nation throughout our lives. Shabbat Shalom.